Hi guys, very good morning to you. Welcome to the first episode of uh, Goft Go. You must be wondering what I'm doing in this park uh, uh, with this uh, basil plants all around, uh, uh, with this uh, uh, beautiful uh, surrounding uh, that you can see. And uh, look at these uh, trees. Uh, which have been planted in such a formation and uh, I'm just trying to identify the, uh, which are these trees. Uh, sometime back I came to this park I saw uh, a drumstick uh, 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 plants. In fact uh, look at this uh, drumstick uh, trees. Can you see this uh, uh, drumstick? Well, that's a hanging drumstick. Uh, uh, heard of uh, this uh, vegetable, guys? Uh, this is sahajan, uh, a very important ingredient uh, uh, in uh, Bengali uh, cuisine. Uh, in fact, it's uh, very healthy, very nutritious, uh, and it is one of the uh, wonder uh, uh, vegetables. Uh, 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 slightly chewer, uh, but uh, uh, if you get it baby like uh, uh, like this uh, uh, It will be very soft uh, uh, But not the other one that's too hanging you know That's a big daddy uh, that will be rather very full of fiber anyway uh, uh, So the idea is uh, not to tell you about the drumstick uh, plant guys the idea is uh, tell you about uh, one of the uh, uh, very important uh, things which affects our life and more so uh, during uh, lockdown and what is that uh, that is a continuous uh, uh, Bombardment of fake news. I don't know from where it comes uh, But every time I open my social media face be it uh, Facebook uh, Instagram or WhatsApp uh, Well, I find one or the other fake news which has no basis no justification, no historical background. Uh, you see, to tell you, only yesterday in our WhatsApp group, uh, a guy who passed out uh, from uh, IIT, yes, you heard me right, he passed out from IIT, and that too from IIT Kharagpur. Uh, you see, IIT Kharagpur, IIT Kharagpur. Uh, is the oldest IIT established by established by uh, Pandit Nehru way back in the uh, 50s. Well, that guy was uh, uh, he forwarded uh, when uh, uh, post uh, that said uh, that uh, the uh, famous uh, Vietnam War in the uh, 70s, uh, which almost uh, uh, went on for as long as 10 years. Uh, after the war uh, got over, someone asked the president of uh, Vietnam, as you know, I'll give you certain uh, uh, historical backdrops of Vietnam. Vietnam, in, uh, uh, before uh, that uh, famous Vietnam War was uh, uh, divided between North and uh, uh, South Vietnam, ruled by different uh, uh, rulers, and uh, there started the virtual proxy war of uh, Soviet Union. Uh, which was the ex-altar of uh, uh, present-day Russia plus uh, other CIS countries uh, like uh, uh, Ukraine, uh, Latvia, Uzbekistan, uh, uh, Kyrgyzstan, like that. Uh, uh, that time it was one uh, united Soviet Union. So that Soviet Union was fighting a proxy war against the United States and that uh, went on uh, for all the, as long as 10 years and finally the Americans, uh, the left, uh, finding no further interest uh, to continue that war that cost them trillions and trillions of money. And remember, that was still 70s. Anyway, that is the backdrop of uh, that uh, historical uh, uh, war that was fought uh, in uh, East Asia between two superpowers of that time, United States and Soviet Union. But the post yesterday I saw was that uh, when after uh, the war was over and the president of uh, Vietnam was asked, uh, uh, well, how you feel and how you got uh, uh, victory in this uh, uh, protracted war, then he said, 
Uh, I always get inspired by Rana Pratap Singh, one of the ruler in a place called India, who had to fight for his uh, uh, kingdom against uh, uh, the uh, ruler of that time, the greatest uh, Akbar. And uh, well, uh, so I got inspired because he had to uh, leave his kingdom along with his uh, uh, king and son, and he stayed. Uh, uh, in uh, jungles and uh, ate uh, rotis uh, made of uh, wild grass and uh, uh, well uh, uh, reformed and uh, his uh, army and uh, strengthened himself and attacked and uh, got back his kingdom. Well, and uh, there was a very uh, emotional appeal to uh, share and forward that post. Well, I'll say that's uh, utterly a nonsense and a fake post that has been running on the social media for the uh, uh, last uh, almost uh, five years or so. And it has been uh, said so many times that please do not uh, uh, believe and uh, forward uh, this fake news. There is no substance. Uh, uh, because uh, to tell you, if you go outside India, uh, which I got a chance to do uh, uh, multiple of times. There are very few Indians who are known outside and who are celebrated, who are idolized and who are worshipped. Uh, one of that uh, fellows is uh, Mahatma Gandhi and uh, the others are Buddha, whom uh, uh, for Buddha, uh, the uh, uh, man on whom uh, Buddhism was formed and uh, uh, spread all over the world and uh, and then, uh, 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 of course, uh, uh, Akbar the Great uh, and uh, Vivekanand and, uh, uh, well, uh, uh, who else? Uh, in fact, Nehru is also a very well-known character and, uh, uh, like, uh, uh, sportsman, uh, like uh, 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 Milka Singh and, uh, uh, like that, in fact, uh, Tandulkar is not well known because there are very few cricketing uh, playing countries. Uh, uh, but uh, in fact, you'll, if you talk about uh, the cricketer, uh, the most uh, celebrated cricketer outside India, uh, n uh, known is uh, Kapil Dev, uh, the OCL is all rounder who won uh, your uh, first uh, World Cup. But that is only in uh, 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 the countries who are familiar with cricket. So, so guys, the idea is uh, there are uh, uh, very few Indians who are known outside India and who are exemplified and who are celebrated and who are quoted. So, it's uh, just an example how uh, these fake news uh, travel on uh, uh, medium, uh, I'll say, WhatsApp University. So, you have to be wary of such news uh, uh, because uh, mm, uh, you are a uh, intelligent man the god has given you mind uh, of your own to think and decide and uh, well uh, you have to use your foresight and uh, intellect uh, to weigh whether the news is uh, uh, genuine or not and uh, uh, well uh, uh, if uh, you forward it only when you have firm belief that it's a genuine news that uh, it will uh, definitely add some value and uh, it will uh, uh, make people uh, to understand a better uh, uh, inside of a particular thing, uh, so only forward that. Uh, and unless if you are not sure, please don't do that because you are not going uh, to do any favor. In fact, you are do going to do a lot of damage because there are so many gullibles, there are so many uneducated people, there are so many people who are not evolved like uh, you and me. So they are going to believe it, and uh, well, it's a very uh, a vicious circle. And you want to realize uh, the fake news uh, which started from you, one, thing, one day it will come back to you and you'll say, hey, oh my God. So, uh, like this, uh, so, uh, in fact, uh, that's it uh, uh, for uh, today, guys. And, uh, well, uh, and uh, you must be wondering what I'm doing in this park, but I'll tell you, well, I felt like uh, coming in open place. I don't come uh, quite often, but uh, sometimes uh, I do come because uh, this energizes me. It gives me energy. Uh, you see, the uh, fresh air is so important. Uh, 
Uh, it really, you see, when I come to this uh, such open place and park, like this rock garden, I look at uh, this beautiful flowers and uh, uh, this uh, rock uh, and uh, well and uh, this uh, palm tree and like that, uh, it uh, 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 immensely pleases me. I think about uh, uh, this uh, uh, things around and I, I uh, come to understand that the biggest teacher uh, is not uh, your universities uh, or uh, the engineering colleges, uh, the IITs, the IMs, the FMSs and uh, uh, the top uh, iconic uh, Ivy League universities like Stanford uh, and Harvard and Oxford and Cambridge but the nature because uh, uh, it teaches you about so many things. It teaches you uh, to be selfless. Look at this neem uh, 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 tree and look at this neem uh, 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 fruit. Too. Look at this uh, fruit, uh, this beautiful fruit. Do you know the virtue of this yellow small neem fruit? Well, if you take one daily the diabetes will not dare you come anywhere near to you. So that's it and it doesn't take anything, it always uh, gives you back. Uh, we guys, we uh, take oxygen uh, from uh, uh, the atmosphere uh, and we give carbon dioxide back. You know, these trees, they take that carbon dioxide, take and they release oxygen. Such a beautiful selfless act. And look at this, uh, uh, these beautiful clouds. Isn't it uh, so beautiful, serene? Huh? Because a week back it was so hot and humid, now it's so cool uh, with this uh, uh, almost daily shower and uh, these hovering clouds. Uh, which has really turned the climate uh, from a hot, humid uh, to cold and uh, very, very pleasant. Uh, look at these flowers, uh, the pinks and whites uh, and scarlets and again whites. Uh, I mean, like the sky is the limit. Yes, gentlemen, look at the sky. The sky is the limit. Uh, you'll never get tired of uh, uh, nature. So, try to imbibe as much of nature inside you don't hanker after the college degrees you get one okay fine but if you're not getting don't think that is it's ends all for it try to talk uh, with the nature uh, try to be as close to nature as possible and try to learn because in nature is all also the biggest teacher the teacher which doesn't talk to you but it talks it nonetheless talks in many ways through its acts through its beauty through its uh, selfless uh, 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 well acts uh, and uh, in fact uh, that is the best thing the earth can offer you to you to me and all of us so that's it guy for uh, today's uh, a gift go. Take care. Stay safe. I love you all. Bye.